Howdy y'all, and welcome to Lex Lives. I think it's time to play a little Infotech 2. Alright, so last episode I left off, I was, uh, what, making TNT or getting ready to make TNT? Um, man, I really need to find a spot where I can tap into power cables in a way that's beneficial to me. Uh, this used to be a spot where I tapped into power cables, but I've gone and removed everything involved in that. Um, this down here could potentially work. Uh, maybe if I take this chemical bath off. Run those down there, maybe? Don't really use this scanner. Let's pop that out of there. Uh, I think I need the... Actually, doesn't this chemical reactor have... No, I was thinking I had one of those already set up with some of my ingredients in it, but maybe not. Didn't I pull off two machines? Scanner and... Oh yeah, there it is. Basic chemical bath. Okay. Oh. Where did I put my new machines? Down here. There we go. Okay. Oh, I was just downplaying with my, my storage drawers trying to uh, get things arranged. It was a bit of a mess, and uh, it wasn't working well, so I have... Uh, emptied most of my storage drawers. You know, they actually don't reach this end here at all. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. I don't know if I'll reach any of these, to be honest. I think it does, but it wasn't filling any of these on the edge. And so it is currently... currently running through several chests worth of ore. I removed all the uh, dust and gems, and crushed ore. Uh, and then I moved most of the chests. Those are, these wooden chests are all new I made today. I can't fit through here. Uh, and I've actually moved the chests back down here so they can fill back up. <clears throat> this is all new since last time. Uh, it did hit a uh, spawner that I hadn't discovered yet, and uh, I got some ingots out of it that I already placed in my ingot chest, so uh, that's pretty cool. Good old quarry. Uh, so, let's see. TNT. Okay, step one. Um, okay, let's look at this one. I need a chemical reactor No. I need... Hydrogen sulfide? Oh, man. I think this is what I need, right? No. Okay. I had a whole plan on how to fill this out, and now I don't know what happened to it. Uh, let's start with this one then. Okay, uh, so to make the toline, I just need a distillery with my cracked heavy fuel in it. So let's start with that. Uh, basic distillery. Okay. Uh, basic distillery with a circuit on three. I actually think I've got an extra right here, integrated circuit. Uh, but I gotta switch it to three, which is <laughs> screwdriver in the upper right hand corner. I can never remember how to adjust these. So there we go. 
That one's on three. And then... Where did I put my barrel of cracked heavy fuel? And then any chance I've got some pressurized conduit around here? I do. There is so much, so many gems uh, that I don't have room for them all. It's crazy how many gems I got from that quarry. Uh, not, there's not a lot of them, uh, so it's not like it's, oh man, I've got so many gems. Uh, no, it's more like um, there's so many different kinds of gems. Okay, so there's the liquid toline, and then, uh, and then I need the solidifier next. Okay, with that in it. So you can, no, not item, fluid. Oh, yeah. Let's make sure that's going the right direction, too. Okay, there's my jelly toline. All right, that was easy. Uh, so now I just got to remember how to make this sulfuric acid. Um, I thought I was doing something with water. Water and hydric. Oh, yeah, water and sulfur dust. That's what I was going to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So, next I need then my chemical reactor. And we'll go. Oh, that's not where I wanted you. Oh, yeah, because this needs connected to water. So, let's, uh, let's go ahead and plop you right there. All right. And then I will go get some more. Um, do do do. We'll just use some plain fluid conduit here. Oh, hmm. Okay. There's your water, and then I also need. Um. I'm going to need some of this, too. I also need uh, another circuit. And I need this one set to... One. Okay. So that's a uh, circuit. Integrated circuit. Screwdriver. Set to one. Um, I think that should let the water in. Yep, okay. And then I need sulfur dust. Uh, oh yeah, I've got tons of sulfur dust. Okay. Alright, so there's my sulfuric acid. And then I just need a chemical reactor to take in the toline and sulfuric acid. Yay. Uh, and so I think I need to make another chemical reactor was the deal, right? I ran out of, ran out of time before I made one. I need uh, 10... Oh yeah, I gotta make an electric motor, right? Because I don't have any any electric motors available. That was that was the big showstopper last episode. Uh, so that's a, what? A magnetic iron rod. Um, I think it's just iron rods, right? Yeah. Uh, Alright, well... Let me have an iron ingot. 
And... Let me click on the right machine. <laughs> Okay, there we go. And let's hope I have enough, uh, 10 cable. Probably have to make some more. Okay, I need, uh, four copper wire. Oh, dang it. I'm gonna have to make more 10 wire. Because... I need to make an LV machine hull, which is going to take the rest of my 10 wire. That sucks. Or my 10 cable, I mean. All right, give me the black carpet and string. Let me have some 10 ingots nope that's the alley smelter, that's the alley smelter polar, there we go wait stop trying to put carpet on things oh look you got some copper wire in you I'm gonna go shear some sheep I think get some more wool going see if that doesn't help things out Yeah, while I was uh, moving things around, um, the uh, uh, the uh, various storage drawers were filling up, and so I'd pull something out, and then it would start filling that in because it was the next one in order. Stuff was just a huge mess, and so. I uh, pulled it all down so that it could uh, fill in a little better than it currently was. And maybe get all the way across, I'm not sure. I can't believe it's all still pulling the same ingredient. That's crazy. I have a lot of some kinds of ores, man. Alright. Uh... I can't remember. Do you put the carpet in the cutter? Or the black wool? Oh yeah, I think that's the same... Same as it does the other way, so... I think you get three from it, at least. I'm using a machine. Come on. Uh, Alright, how you doing with my... My wire? Okay. Wire... Carpet, string, string. All right, now I've got my tin cable. Go back over here. Uh, let's dump the shears, the tin wire, uh, copper cable. I need two circuits. Uh, oops. I need um, glass. Yeah. Glass, glass, glass. Two glass. And a ten rotor. Okay. Circuit, circuit. Glass, glass. Motor. Rotor. Machine hull. And cables in the wrong spot. Uh, boom. There we go. One chemical reactor. Okay. Item output. Wow, I'm sorry. Uh, and I guess since you are the way you are, I'll just go ahead and do this and this and this. Um... And you can fluid output. Oh no. 
Dang it, it filled up with biomass. I don't want biomass in there. Oh, where's my wrench? We told you to fill up with biomass, man. Uh, let's just go ahead and knock it off here. The only thing I'm missing is a little bit of biomass that I don't care about at the moment. Alright, and then I probably... What do I do with all those chests I had? Where did I put those? I had a whole bunch of them. Um... Oh look, I've got storage upgrades. Dude, I need to be using these. Uh, chest, 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 chest. Chest, where did I dump off those chests? Oh, maybe I used them all. That's weird. I don't think I did use them all, but maybe I did. I don't believe I did, but I don't know what I did with them either. Alright. Uh, where are you going? You actually need that chest up here, buddy. Okay. Put your nice chest there, and you can item output to the chest, and I now have... TNT production. Awesome. Okay. Now. Um, so, I was working on Space Explorers. And I need 10 compressed steel. 10 compressed bronze. 10 compressed 10. 10 aluminum. 10 iron. Uh, and it's, it's made, I know it's made in the, uh, implosion compressor, which is why I was making all the TNT, uh, and it's two, two ingots, okay, so I need 20 ingots of bronze, oh, I've got it, wow, look at that, 20 ingots of bronze, 20 ingots of tin, Ooh, that takes me pretty low on 10. Uh, 20 ingots of iron. Uh, I already have some steel done. So I'm going to have to look to see how much more steel I need. And 20 ingots of aluminum. Uh, how many steel did I get done? Four. So that's, uh, 6 times 2 is 12. 12 steel. Okay. I wonder if we can just throw all those in there all at the same time. Uh, soft hammer. No. Does it not go in there? Does it go in here? I can't remember. I just used it. I don't... I think it takes... Does it take power? I can't remember. It's plugged in. 
Yeah, yeah, it's plugged in. Hmm. I know I had to hit it with the soft hammer last time to get to do something. It should do something. Okay, <laughs> I'm going to take a nap. Make it daytime. There's plenty of steam. There should be plenty of power. It made some last time. What's your issue? I still think this might go in here. No? <laughs> Why? You worked last episode. What's your problem? Am I doing it wrong? I'm doing it wrong. That's the problem. I'm an idiot. Uh, you know what? I got steel plates on me. It's not ingots unless you're using the other machine. <laughs> All right, there we go. Ten compressed steel. Awesome. Wow, that's weird that 10 takes so much longer than aluminum to turn into plates. Bronze is taking a while, though, too. <laughs> awesome. Oh, you guys need to hurry up. Uh-oh. I've done worked my way through my heavy fuel. Apparently it's not enough tooling to make uh, any more jellied tooling. That's it for TNT until I make more fuel of some kind. It's okay. It should be enough to finish off this quest. Of course, the next quest is probably going to want compressed stuff, and I won't have it because I'll use it all on this quest. Uh, you're probably about done, right? Yeah. Oh. Hmm. I don't have enough, actually. I'm shy by six TNT. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, cracked heavy fuel, heavy fuel, 
cracked light fuel. Uh, oh, distillation tower. Oh, wait, heavy fuel. Let me, uh, grab this guy. And... I think this is set up to make heavy fuel. Oh, sulfuric heavy fuel. Right. Right, so I have to get the sulfur out. Uh, which is done with... chemical reactor. <laughs> uh, isn't this chemical reactor? Sulfuric heavy fuel and hydrogen right there. Isn't that what I'm making? I gotta look again. Not this one, this one. Not this one, this one. Hydrogen. Right, and it makes hydrogen sulfide. Sulfuric heavy fuel. Yeah, yeah, right here. It's actually what this guy was doing. Alright. Uh, what can I do with the hydrogen sulfide cell? Hi whoops. Hydrogen sulfide. Uh... Oh, I can make sulfuric acid out of it, actually. Huh. Uh. So, I will keep these, then. Oh. Dude, there's jelly toline right there. I knew I had some somewhere. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to be six more worth, though. Alright, so that guy's going to take a while to fill up. And then I'm going to need... I'm going to need more hydrogen cells. Hydrogen... Cells are... An electrolyzer... I think... Yeah, just an electrolyzer with water. Uh, which... No, this guy was making chlorine. Man, everybody's trying to make as much noise as possible while I'm recording. Uh, okay, I think I'm gonna... Empty... Empty out the chlorine here. Because that's made with, uh, salt. And then, um, somewhere in all of this, I have got to have some empty cells. Look, there's more jelly tooling. Oh, dude, I made enough. I had enough. Uh, and then you need... Oh, I didn't even grab them. Iron plates. We're gonna do this. Iron plates. I still need to find out what I did with my... cells. You got cells? Uh, there's some hydrogen cells I actually need. Uh, compressed air cells, I can empty those. I think. Uh, not here, I guess, but... Uh, you... Can use hydrogen cells. Ooh, later. Alright. 
There are all the ingredients I need for this one. Oh, look, I get to use them. Breathe. Oxygen gear is really important in space. Uh, so next up is to make an oxygen mask. Oxygen mask. Uh, so I need reinforced glass around a scuba helmet. Okay. Reinforced glass is advanced alloy or carbon plates and glass in the alloy smelter. Uh, hmm. I wonder which is easier. Probably carbon and... No, not the carbon dust. I want the, it's the charcoal dust that needs to be transformed. The carbon dust goes... Oh, you know what? It's probably not easier because this goes in with the platinum. But I've got plenty of platinum, so for me, it's not that bad, actually. this sorted a little bit here. Uh, how many do you get for that? I need eight. And you get four for each plate. So I need two plates. So that's not bad at all. Uh, that's, uh, Carbon mesh in the compressor, it said. Bam, bam. And then the rest of these can go in here, I guess. To make me tape for when I need more tape. Alright, well, I think I'm probably going to call it here, and we will continue working on our oxygen gear next time. So click like if you like, subscribe, share, and catch the next one, and I will talk to you later.